I love you, media without romance. And I especially love you, character-centric media that explores the bonds between characters but still has no romance. May I offer you Hollowed Bonds by Andy. Andy, plug it now. Do it. Timepiece with the fewest moving parts, Sundial. Timepiece with the most moving parts, Hourglass. Wait, wait, hold on. Wait, wait, what? Perceive the tantrum hole. Uh, I think you mean the waste pipe for the cream cheese frosting factory? No, that's a goose that is definitely venting into the void. Guy who just had like three weeks to do several things and didn't do them. Boy, I need a week off. Mood. What's the trope name for when someone finds out they're the chosen one and is like, no thank you, and goes and does something else? Common sense. Gifted kid burnout. Yeah, the refusal of the call is the actual trope name, usually followed by the tropes of the call knows where you live and you can't fight fate. The call is trying to contact you about your destiny's extended warranty. <laughs> Trades my imperfect flesh for the immortality of the machine. You know, re should have ended that way. We need bear girls. And I don't mean skinny, cutesy teddy bear girls. We need fat bear women who catch salmon in their jowls and eat cigarettes like that Polish bear from WW2. We need built bear girls that climb trees and terrorize picnics. Andy, just put up your favorite sample of this character, please. So let's get ready to crumble. God, I hope she steps on me. Person who is chronically outside. They see discourse and just go, who? Man, this is just like when two sparrows want the same sunflower seed. I'm sorry, did you mean wander? Need a full body massage, a margarita, 400 milligrams of ibuprofen, a plate of brownies, at least an hour in a jacuzzi, and $20,000 cash. The mouse after you give him a cookie. Due to not wanting to, I will not. Thanks. The only people who get upset when you set boundaries are the ones who benefited from you having none. That's why they perceive it as a personal attack. Because your boundary enroaches on space they were used to owning. Yours. It did psychic damage to me, seeing both Spider-Verse and Barbie trending at the same time. The girlies. The girlies have been fed. Look out, they're frothing today. Someone who doesn't watch Markiplier. Explain this picture. Mankind attempted to invent a combustible banana, but he got sad about the results. You know what? Sorry, Mark, that's what happened now. Why is it so easy to get a headache? Like, I'm just trying to do my work and enjoy my time, but then my brain decides, no, nah, you're not allowed to, and I'm going to make it extremely painful for you to exist for the next few hours. <laughs> Love is in the air. Wrong! Flaming skull! <laughs> is there a support group for people who wake up on time but lay in the bed until it makes them late? Yeah, literally everybody. Everyone has a ship that's just... They're perfect. They hate each other. They're married. They haven't spoken in 15 years. They have date nights three times a week. They're divorced. They're pining. It's unrequited. It's requited. They're star-crossed. They're meant to be. They're doomed by the narrative. They love each other. They never held hands. They won't stop making out of parties. They can't look each other in the eye. Man, I forgot ships have, like, multiple genres. My little brother came into my room and told me that there was water all over the bathroom floor, so I got up and grabbed a towel and ran into the bathroom to find all of my water energy Pokemon cards sprawled on the floor. This kid is five fucking years old, and he got me. <laughs> That's really funny. Mm, some people on this site aren't even funny. They just have funny followers who make comedic additions to their otherwise bland text posts. Well, I'm glad you're self-aware. Sorry for sending my friends the Wikipedia page for the death penalty whenever they say something ungodly. Being the family's assigned it person is fun because everyone gets annoyed when you don't know what to do. Also, they don't try to do or teach themselves anything because they can just get you to do it for them. And it's such a chore to put on the Pennywise makeup every day too, like, ugh. Oh, you meant IT. Whoever has my voodoo doll, please take that bitch to the gym. Thank you. Child gates are the equivalent of blocked off areas in video games due to your character's level. What's it mean that my nephew just fucking bowls over them with his massive baby body? Speedrun strats. Oh god, oh god, I can hear it. Andy, watch out, it's the speedrun baby!